Hey guys, Carolyn here. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Golden Child's first full-length album, Reboot, and I am super, super excited about this. Um, they finally made a comeback after about a year, and I'm super happy to have this album. I bought the deluxe edition as well as the normal edition, so yeah, I think we'll start with the deluxe edition and then do the normal edition after. Like most Woolen Limited things this was well expensive but also super hard to find oh my gosh but yeah there is the track list i started listening to the album last night but i haven't finished it yet but so far super good i'm super impressed with it um but yeah let us see what comes in this okay so i took everything out and we have the cd back here which is super nice. And then it looks like you get a... <gasps> so you pull one of these random in um, both the normal and limited editions and I pulled Sungyun, who is one of my biases. Oh my God. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my God, that, oh my gosh. I'm so happy about that. <gasps> Yay, Sungyun. I really did not want to trade for these, so, oh my gosh, that is so exciting. So yeah, you get that. It looks like there's a bunch of other things, but there's a photo book too. Sorry, I just saw that signature, so I was like, oh my gosh, but <laughs> um, let's look through the photo book, and then we'll do all the extra goodies and stuff. So, oh my gosh, that is so exciting though. So, here we have the boys. I want to talk about this concept as an in-spirit, because... Inspirit's biggest fear Inspirit's biggest fear when Goldchild were getting ready to debut was that they would have the same concept as Infinite. Um, which I still don't don't feel like this is exactly the same, but I definitely think that this concept change is a little more infinite, but honestly, I'm okay with it. It doesn't really matter. I think they killed this comeback. I think it is super good. Jung Jun, oh my god, King, look at him. Um Sun Yoon also looks so good. My two biases are Jung Joon and Sun Yoon Y. So, yes. Oh my gosh. Dong Hyun looks so good. Bowman looks so good. Oh my gosh. Ju Chan. Seeing Ju Chan with Golden Child again. So freaking nice. Bowman. Oh my gosh. Look at them. Oh, we have both my biases on the same spread. So cute. Oh, Dale. Dale looks more and more like Sung Yul every time I see him. Freaking miss Sung Yul. Oh my gosh, Sung Yul, look how cute. But yeah, I wasn't even sure if this was actually going to be like a dark concept because... Oh my gosh, Juchan looks so good there. What the heck? Yeah, um... I wasn't sure if this was going to be a dark concept because for their last album, they like teased kind of a darker concept and then it was Genie or, um, yeah. And I was like, this is not, <laughs> this is not what we thought it was, but yeah, look at you, bomb. Oh my gosh. King, king, king. Why didn't they put Juchan's like picture here next to his solo? I feel like that's weird. I think it's weird when companies don't, like, take advantage of that. But, yeah. This was one of my most anticipated comebacks of November. I'm so freaking happy. So this is here. We actually got a Golden Child comeback in 2019. So amazing. I've been very distracted with my, my ultimates. So I'm not exactly sure how this album is doing uh, chart-wise, um, but I hope it's doing really well. Oh my gosh, I love Juchan's pink hair so freaking much. Oh my gosh, they look so good. Wannabe's line distribution is um, okay, um, Justice for Bowman, but besides that i'm pretty happy with it i feel like i saw a lot of members um that you don't usually see and bowman is one of the most popular members so they did it again <laughs> they put jibum next to singing solo i don't understand um 
But yeah. They're so nice. <gasps> Jung Jun there. Oh my god, look at him. We have some Bayo. But yeah, I don't understand why we oh got like no lines. Oh, so sad. That poor little Mung Nae. Oh my gosh, he looks so good though. Look at him go. He looks so much older than he actually is in these photos. Like he's a baby. I guess maybe not a baby. I'm just old. But I don't know. Anyways. Oh my gosh, Jaehyun. And then here we have the thanks twos in age order. So we have Daeyeol, Seungyun, Jungjun. Uh... Tag, Seungmin, Jaehyun, Jibom, Donghyun, Juchan, and Bowman. And then we have some credits. So that's the photo book. You also get a bunch of other things though. So let's go through these. This, I believe, is a calendar, which it is. I wonder if Gulchai will still release the season's greetings or if they're just going to do this. I don't think Bullim's actually announced their season's greetings yet. Um, but. I think when ATs did a calendar in one of their albums last year, not that they're from the same company, but it just kind of reminds me of what ATs did. Um, I can't get these out, oh my gosh. That they didn't actually end up releasing a real season's greetings. They did this year, but I think there's actually a calendar in both versions of this album. So this might actually be their season's greetings, but there's no way to like stand these. So, yeah, which is nice. It makes me feel like I bought <laughs> Season's Greetings and an album at the same time. Um, there's also, yeah, the calendar and the other one. <gasps> oh, Sungyun is on my birthday month. That is so cute. Oh, I didn't realize that that's the same month that Goldenness was announced as my birthday month. <gasps> oh, I never get my bias on my birthday month. That's so exciting. Um, Jungjun is in July. Keep on. Juchan is in October. Bowman's November. And then we have this group picture for December. So that is the calendar. It's nice that they have 10 members because they can do 10 months and then, or like each member for a month and then a group, two group photos. So that's cool. Um, Oh my gosh. Wollum freaking loves these like weird paper things and I hate them so much. Okay, I'm not putting that back together right now, but those are gonna sit there. And then it looks like we also get maybe a postcard set and a photo card set. So let's look through the postcards. See, I've said this before that I like when, I've literally said this during Wollum unboxings before, I like postcards when they all have the same back, I'm pretty sure. Um, I like postcards when you get them as an extra. I don't want them to be like what you get in the album and that's it. Like with Lovely's last limited edition. Mm -mm. No, don't do that ever again. Okay, so that... Are there two sets of postcards? I think there are. Okay, hold on. Oh my gosh, so nice. I like these a lot. Kind of want to put at least Sinyun and Jungjun's in my binder. Oh my gosh, I like these a lot. But yeah, this is the same picture as that. Okay, so those are the postcards. And then I really didn't think that they'd give you a photo card set, but we got a photo card set, which is why I'm also thinking they're not releasing a Season's Greetings because... Wollum groups normally get a full set of photo cards for Season's Greetings. Not that that's exclusive to Wollum, but um, yeah. So yeah, we've got a full set of photo cards. So I guess we will go through all the backs because yeah, they feel super thin. These both Dale. Is this really Dale? Is this, this is really, this is really Dale. He looks so different here. We have a two <laughs> Singing so this, this is the weirdest selfie card ever. Oh my gosh. And then we have this one. This one's really cute. I probably will keep all 
of these in my binder though because I love you. Oh, so cute tag. Someone said I love you too. That is so cute. Are the signatures different? Oh, they are different. Weird. Okay. I've got some Jaehyun. Some Jibum. Some uh, Dongin. And some uh, Jichan. And some Bowman. So cute. Oh my gosh. So yeah, that, that means that this is the only random item that actually comes in the limited edition. And I pulled my bias and that is so freaking exciting. I'm so excited about that. But also you get a full set of, two full sets of photo cards, which is a really nice deal. Um, this is probably one of my favorite like woolen limited editions they've done in a while. This was really nice. But let's move on to the normal edition now because I know that that is what's going to be more readily available. But yeah, I probably won't even keep this in my binder to be honest. I'll probably just keep it in my in my album um, because it's so big. I actually don't even know if it'll fit in my album, my binder. But yeah, the photo cards and the maybe some of the postcards I'll definitely keep in my binder. This is the normal edition of the album. It's still pretty freaking big. Normally, normal editions are smaller, I feel like. But yes. Um... Oh, okay. So I pulled um, Bowman for this guy. Oh, it's white on the back. Interesting. I wonder if there's two sets. That would make me sad. But I don't know. They're like from the same concept. Also, sometimes for Golden Child, half of their things are one color and half of the things are the other color. And it's very confusing. But um, yeah. So I don't know if I would trade this for Jungjun, but because I just don't want to go through the hassle of mailing it. But if you're in the U.S. and you have Jungjun and want to trade, I also don't know that many people that collect Golden Child. So <laughs> yeah. Um, there's a photo card in here too. I have to make sure I get that out. The CD is in the photo book. So we will look through the photo book. And then, like I said, there's also a 2020 calendar in here. So I wonder if this is the same photo book. No, I don't think it is. It's similar. It's the same concept, but it's not the same photos, which I'm always okay with because, yes. Oh my gosh. It will never not make me happy that my biases are next to each other in age. Though I just said that and it made me feel sad because I'm pretty sure Jaysook was in between them at one point when Jaysook was in the group. <sighs> Do I stay in any groups anymore that haven't lost members? I have BTS and VIX. And Shiny is always five. And 17. Okay, well, I, I, guess, I, guess, I guess I have some... Oh my gosh, Jung Jun looks so good there. Oh, nice. I wonder what Willem's gonna do next year. I mean, we have Sungyu coming back in January, so Sungyu will definitely get at least one solo thing, if not two, next year, because let's be real, he keeps the lights on. <laughs> and then um, I'm sure we'll have Willem Boys from Produce debut, as long as um, that all works out. Mm, I don't know. But, or at least some other thing. And then I hope we'll get lots of Golden Child and Rocket Punch and Lovelies as well next year. Because Rocket Punch did really well. I'd like to see a comeback from them early next year. Um, they had a really big impact on their debut. It was nice. A lot of my non woolen friends were impressed and that's always a good sign. Uh, again, they did this normal edition. Singing solo, we have Bowman in there. But, oh my gosh, so handsome. 
They've all grown up so much. I mean, Dale was already, like, you know, an adult when they debuted, but... Oh my gosh. So handsome, oh my god. Ooh, I like these photos so much. Cinnamon and Bowman look so good. And then we have the Thanks Twos again. Um, in the same age order. And this is the CD or the normal edition. And then, like I said, you also get a 2020 calendar in the normal edition. So let us look through this. I'm actually super excited that I got a golden child calendar. I was like, oh, I'm not gonna buy a season's greetings from Willem this year because I'm deciding which ones I want. Um, oh, so pretty. Sorry, this is not showing this off well. It's kind of weird. Um, but I'm definitely buying SJs. A Pink haven't announced one yet. I don't know if they'll get one, but if they do, I will buy theirs. Um, and then I've decided not to buy the Monster X one, though I probably will buy the photo card set and the postcard set on eBay at some point in 2020. Um, but. Is he in May again? Oh, yay! Best boy! Oh my gosh. Um, so that's really it for Season's Greetings. So I'm happy that I got, like, it feels like I got another Season's Greetings. And I have my Wano Season's Greetings. I bought a fan site Wano Season's Greetings. So that will be coming. I keep forgetting about that because it'll probably take a while to come in because it's a fan site one. But I'm super excited about that. I think I bought Juicehale Wano's one. Um, was one of my favorite one of fan sites so i'm very excited for that but yeah I'm happy i got this it feels like i bought a season's greetings already plus this is so smart you release an album in november it has a season's greetings in it therefore you already have your season's greetings for next year if your other ones take forever to come in the mail genius Willem, that's the smartest thing I've literally ever seen you do. Ever. And if fans want to buy the season's greetings, they just buy the album. They might still get a season's greetings. I don't know. But anyways, let's look at the photo card I pulled. So obviously it was red for Golden Child on the limited edition ones. And these are gray. And I think I know who I pulled. So, oh my gosh. So yes, I pulled, I pulled Bowman. <laughs> Literally pulled a Bowman set. It was so funny. Um, I would trade this card for either Sunyun or Jun. So if you do have either of their cards and you want to trade, do let me know. Uh, you can message me on my Trader and Sale Instagram, One Eyed Trades, and we can go about doing that. Yeah, as far as this one goes for Jung Jun, I don't know. I don't know if I would trade that, but definitely want to trade the photo card. So yeah. So yes, that is it for my unboxing of Golden Child. First full length album reboot, both the deluxe and the normal edition. Like I said, I'm super happy this makes me feel like I already have a season's greetings <laughs> in my possession. And I'm so freaking happy that these boys finally got to come back after Woolen literally neglecting them all year. Um, and I hope that you give this album a lot of love. And if you haven't heard it or you haven't heard the title track Wannabe, it is so good. And I really think you should check it out. Um, but yes, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see what else I have coming, go ahead and look in the description box down below. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.